Turn it on. And it's done. Mmm. I should have put more Oreos. It's cool though, it's cool. Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe. Today I'll be showing you two vegan protein powder shake recipes. I got these recipes from Chubby Cheeks TV. I'll link her channel up here so you guys can go subscribe to her and I'll also have it in the description. The first recipe is a Biscoff cookie and peanut butter shake. It's so good. This is what I'll be using to make the shakes. This brand is Hotch, 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 Hotch. Yeah, so it's Hotch. The brand is Hotch, but it's just a, you know, independent, individual blender. But you can also use like a regular blender if you want, you know, and just make like, whatever. I'll show you all the ingredients that go into this shake. First thing you'll need is your Tone It Up protein. You can get any like protein um, that you want, you know. I just like this one because it just tastes really good and it's, it's plant-based, hence the vegan. And it's vanilla flavored. So. You'll take a cup of that, put it in here. Boop. Next, you'll take your flaxseed. I got this off Amazon. You'll take one tablespoon of your flaxseed. This works to keep you full. So next, you're gonna get one spoon of peanut butter. I use Jif, just make sure you get creamy. Pecan with nuts is not gonna work. Just take a spoonful of that, throw that thing in there. Next, you'll take your candied walnuts. These are from Trader Joe's. I didn't go to Trader Joe's, but I did find them online at Amazon. You'll take about five of these. These taste really good too. Next, you'll take your Biscoff cookies. Sorry, that was my mom. If you see this, hi mom. So anyway, you'll take your two Biscoff cookies. Take one, crunch it in half. For the second one, you're just gonna put it in a paper towel and like crunch it up, and then that'll be the topping, you know? So, wrap it up like a Christmas present and crunch that thing up. There, we'll set this to the side. All we have left now is almond milk and ice. Ice, ice, baby. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay, so we got our milk. I just use Walmart brand. You ain't gotta have nothing fancy. I mean, unless you really want to, but don't be extra. So, just take like a cup of almond milk and you pour that on in there. Beautiful. Last thing to add, milk. Wait, whoops. Last thing to add, ice. I use ready ice, cause I stay ready. I notice when I put too much ice, there'll still be like little ice pieces in it and I don't like that. So that's good right there. And you know what you do now, don't you? You know what you do now? I like to shake it up a little bit because you see how at the bottom, the protein powder is like kind of caked looking. So I like to shake it up a little bit before I um, turn it on. Try to get that all up in there. Now, just turn it on. Okay, so you got your little cup, right? Ooh. Oh, it still got some ice, but that's okay. Now you'll add the cookie. I like to make it pretty, so. You see how good that look? Oh, yeah. Now, time for the taste test. Mmm. It tastes so good. You taste the peanut butter, you taste the Biscoff cookie. You can kind of taste the protein shake, but it's not bad. You know, it's not like too overwhelming. The other things that we added to it, balance it out real good. Again, this is the Biscoff cookie and peanut butter shake. Try it and come on back here and let me know down in the comments. Okay, folks, we're back for shake number two. This shake is an Oreo protein shake that is similar to an Oreo milkshake. You know what we start off with? Our Tone It Up Protein. Same as before, one scoopful. 
This recipe is a little bit simpler. You'll take five, five mini Oreos and put them in there. I have these two, the cookie parts. We're gonna crunch those up and put them on top. Okay, we'll add um, a little bit of flaxseed. We'll just use half of a tablespoon. And then we'll take another cup of almond milk. Okay, then ice. Again, you don't need too much ice, you know? And put the top on, shake it up a little bit, turn it on, and it's done. We got our mason jar. Oh, it smells so good. A little ice, but it won't hurt. We'll put our crunched up Oreo on top. Mmm, I should have put more Oreos. It's cool though, it's cool. It's time for the taste test. The moment of truth. Oh, there's an Oreo stuck. Mmm. Yeah, this one's good too. Again, you can kind of taste the protein, but this stuff tastes good. Is that a dance move? I don't know. There we have it. There's our two different vegan protein shake recipes. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please comment down below. Let me know which shake you consider trying. These are both under 300 calories and they are a meal substitute. Let me know what you think when you try them or let me know which one you think you wanna try. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to sub... Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see y'all next time. Bye.